fuck yeah, we found the stairway to heaven. Whoa! Oh, I was naked for a moment. What is up, people, and welcome back to another Souls Like Sunday. Today we play Ex Natura Nature Corrupted, an upcoming action RPG to be released early next year. The demo has just launched on Steam. What do I say about this title screen, huh? No music, no options, nothing. You start the game or you, you exit. So there's that. Ex Natura Nature Corrupted. Oh my good god. What a racket. Huh? Why is it first person for a- Oh! Grant us eyes. Hideous. Is this a horror game or what? Fuck me. Uh, it's a slideshow. You can count the frames on one hand. Yeah, that's bad. Uh, I don't believe there's a way to change settings. Okay, um... Well, none of this shit works. That's that's promising. This is a demo. Perhaps it's locked. How do I leave? You're not even safe. Why do bots It's just too high. What are these? Weird birdmen. But yet they have they have no wings. Oh. Oh, jank ensues. What a train wreck. Press Q to trigger enrage mode. What is this? The, oh, oh, what the fuck? Bro. Text gore. This is a buff. But it won't let me attack now. How do we break the game so quickly? All right, we're fucked. I can't attack. My mouse is here. As you can see, the frames are in the single fucking digits. I'm going for a swim. Fuck all this. Bro, has the, I can't even move the camera. Kill me. Tree man, kill me. Okay. That seemed to work. Did it? Okay, we're good. What the fuck? Never have I seen a game unravel so quickly. Right, let me be clear. I did play this for a bit and it appears to have saved my progress. Which is why I'm here. There's no way to start fresh. So I guess we're playing from here. You haven't really missed much of anything. Other than a barren landscape and a whole bunch of enemies copy and pasted. This weird tree man that belongs in Time Splitters 2. And then birdmen with no wings. What do you mean? Use! Why? I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. We can jump. You can run if you hold down the jump button. There's a hunter's dash. Standard attack with a left click and you can charge it up. Also, there is the enrage mode. Good. Platforming. This might be the worst frame rate I have seen in a video game in recent memory. Yeah, platforming, huh? Platforming in a soul's like That's what we want to see. And it's fucked. But luckily, this game is so jank, you can just kind of parkour around and get shit done. You're really going to put an enemy there, game. Oh, I fucked it up. Yeah, who, you don't even need to go that way, man. Boundary break. There we go. Duh! Good thing this game is as busted as it is. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to progress to show you. Although there's not much to show you, really. I think you've seen enough. But we'll keep going for a while. Holy fuck. Oh, stop. That is a... Okay, if you right-click, you can do this shit. I don't really know what it does. Other than you have some kind of telekinesis, which is for puzzles, allegedly. We're fucked until we find another tree. So we're going to wander around like this, I guess. These are not the droids you are looking for. What's up, bro? Oh, I can't attack. I can't do anything. Oh, because I clicked on my other monitor. I love that. You also move uh, way faster when you do this. Somewhat of a speed running trick, I guess. So, you know, you want to get those PBs, which uh, you don't. Gatekeeper, open up. I can't do anything. I'm going to have to die. I'm going to have to die. Kill me, tree man. Oh, wait. I'm. Am I not dead? There we go. Oh, a shield appeared out of fucking nowhere. <laughs> Why? What? We're back. Right. Don't press E. Do not press E or the game will break. So this is an alpha, so I expect some jank, but this game literally just falls apart the moment you look at it, man. I've never had so many things go wrong within the first two minutes of loading up the game. Although I wasn't anticipating loading my saved game, I thought it would just start again. It's a demo, but I suppose... I suppose it's a good thing that it maintains your progress, but there's no... 
There's no way to restart, so show off some of the attacks. You got your standard attack string, consume stamina, you got this bloodborne bash. And you got this thing. If you do that, yeah, shit gets a little busted. Oh, hello, mate. Oh. You know what? Shoot. Shoot. Get out of here. Shoot. Shoot. Get out of here. Well, where do I got to go? The AI is dumb. You can collect through walls in this game. Some of them, not all of them. If you're insisting I fight all the enemies, I simply refuse. Okay, maybe we can Mario our way over. Oh, come on. Ah, I nearly had it. That's it. We did it. What a boundary break. I don't know if I'm supposed to go this way. This game hasn't really clued me in and what I'm supposed to do. Other than go around fighting shit. It's quite colorful for a Souls-like. Which, uh, you know, whether that's a good or a bad thing, that's a matter of opinion, I suppose. It's kind of refreshing, but the level design is, is utter dog shit. There really isn't any level design going on here. It's just uh, vast, empty rooms and jungle environments. Why is everything locked? Okay, never mind. That's fine. What the fuck? What's the fucking point of any of this? What? Whoa, okay. Fucking hell. I think I'm trapped. I'm, I'm actually fucked. I th what the? How am I doing that? Scoot, scoot. There's probably a wall we can clip through. Yep. Of course there is. Oh, this is where I was. Is it? I don't know. It all looks the bloody same. Dun, 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 dun. What am I looking at? This reminds me of Crystalla. I'd rather not be reminded of that trash heap. That is one big pile of shit. Let's just... Yeah, fuck your doys, bro. I'm going to assume this wasn't playtested. I'm going to assume that I am currently doing the playtesting. Thank me later, devs. What the fuck is this thing? Yes! No, that's bad. It was a checkpoint though. Which is good, I guess. Is it? But now I can't move the camera, so we gotta uh float around like this. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! Is this the most broken game of all time? If you're suffering as much as I am, please tell me. Fucking ah! Uh. Might actually make me sick. I'm stuck. Your game is broken beyond all recognition. Okay, so it appears to have loaded me. Oh! I thought I was naked for a second. Oh! You see down there, it says pre-alpha stage visuals are subject to change. Well, I hope that's not the only thing that's subject to change because this game needs... What? This game needs a lot of work. What is this? It's a white pill. Good news! It's a suppository! What is this? Moldy cheese! This can't be for real, man. What the fuck? Alright guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna reload the game. Of course that means I have to fucking force quit it. Got to love games that don't feature any way to back out of the game or tweak any of the options. Yes, this is a demo, but still, that's inexcusable. Ho oh ho! Oh, it loads me here, man. I found a fucking checkpoint, you donkey. How are you even supposed to make these jumps without just jank parkouring up the side of them? I don't... I guess that was intended, right? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, because this looks good and it's fun to do. Yep, see you later, bud. I, was, well, I scaled the last one. <gasps> oh! Wait, can you jump and dash? You can! Oh! Okay, now I understand. I don't think the game ever explained that. Oh, Superman. I hold silver away. <laughs> Whoa. Are you supposed to be able to Superman in the air? See you later, lads. Holy shit, this frame rate sucks a doll. Oh, I All right, guys. Ah! Oh, what did I press the lock on? Okay, there's a lock on. I can't remember what it was. Basically, I accidentally put sticky keys on and then my audio dropped out. Don't spam shift. Okay, this is like the disco, I guess, going by that thing. There is um, a sort of mechanic in this game where you can move these orbs with telekinesis. And it's for puzzles and shit. The audio is distorting. It sounds revolting. Also, lack of collision on these walls here. Yup. 
Yeah, boy. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Fuck yeah, we found the stairway to heaven. Whoa! Oh, I was naked for a moment. Uh, you know what? You know what? Tree man. Tree beard. That is enough. Let's look at the Steam page. Ex Natura Nature Corrupted is a challenging action-packed Souls-like experience developed by Blackburn Game Studio. Fight your way from the deepest cultist dun dungeons, dungeons, to the top of the holy tree and reclaim your throne in this mysterious pre-human era themed epic story. Dungeons though, didn't really see much of that, but I mean the game broke just just from looking at it, so. Walk within the footsteps of Elri, the god of air, to experience the journey he goes through to claim his throne. Okay, that's why he can Superman dash around, basically. The world of Ex Natura is mysterious, cruel, and filled with deceptions. Yes, many illusory walls. Many. You can clip through pretty much everything. Our protagonist, Elri, will be revisiting and exploring this deceptive world after being banished from his throne. The game pushes the benchmark of indie game graphics to a new level. With our talented team, you will be experiencing the world with the best post-processing and atmospheric effects. Frames be damned. That's all I'm going to say. It can look as nice as you want it to look, but fuck me. If it don't perform well, then your game's fucked. As you progress with the story of Elri, you will witness the change of his powers. Nature Corrupted offers players a wide amount of combos, build types, and play styles. Not that you would know that from playing the demo because the leveling up is balked or it's just not in the demo. Deep and thought-provoking storyline. Is there? Who knows? Progressive difficulty system. I don't, the enemies are brain dead. They're very slow. There's no reason to fight them. You can get around them with ease, at least in the demo. Character progression system. Again, not really present in the demo. Epic bosses with their unique fighting. Didn't see one, didn't find one. Maybe. That's a shame, but whatever. Fun and challenging combat system. No, I don't know about that. Meta game layers for replayability. What does that fucking mean though? Meta game layers. Easy to play, difficult to master. I would argue that it's not easy to play because it breaks within two minutes of loading it. Like You do not have to go out of your way to break this game. Just run into a wall, spam shift, something will break. Like, it's so fucked. I realized that I didn't do a great job showing off this game, but you all saw what happened. And that's, you know, a genuine experience with this game. It could happen to anyone. It happened to me. It could happen to you. Feel free to check it out if you like the look of it. If you really want to do that, probably play something else though. Otherwise, you know what to do, guys. Like the video if you like the video. And I'll see you next time. Subscribe if you are new here. And uh, I'll see you next week for another Souls Like Sunday. Headbang. Goodbye.